Now back to Amy and Sean. 1027 VGS. What does the fuck say? R.I.P. <laughs> Ilvis. So good, by the way. Like, I think they're like a Norwegian comedy group or whatever. Yeah, so really good. good. Um, we were talking earlier about these, uh, the, these uh, Metro officers that were called to the scene of a group of ducks that were crossing the road at Desert Inn and University Drive, which, mm -hmm. if you know the area, I mean, like, not a safe place for ducks. Frankly, any road crossing the yeah. street. Like, during the pandemic, they, they took the strip back. <laughs> Yeah, that was so cute. It really was. Yeah, it was so cute they to see. They just owned the strip. It's mm -hmm. like, yeah, well, okay, the humans are finally gone. Cool. Let's go. Hey, let's walk down the street, go Bellagio. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Um, but uh, to, we're, we're talking about the the moments where you had to save an animal. Uh, this is what the Metro officers did. They brought him over to Sunset Park. Happy ending. Uh, maybe you have as well. 702-597-1027. I know I've done it on a few different occasions, even for animals that didn't want it. How about you? Yeah, we, um, my mom, there's core memory of mine is we would do Disney World like every other year. Like that was the one vacation we always did. Yeah. And because uh, it's so expensive. So like we'd stay on, on um, Disney and it was just like the time of uh, our lives. Well, my mom would always get up early morning and go on her walk and go get her coffee before we'd all get up. And one day we came out and she was holding a baby bunny that she had saved that was tr like wrapped up in to like a net that was in the oh, no. and it was like drowning. Oh. And my mom my mom saved this baby bunny and was just like holding I core memory, I still can see the picture of her holding this bunny. And then we had to like contact Mickey Mouse and be like, what are we supposed to do with this bunny? <laughs> <laughs> no, this and, is at Walt Disney World. World. In the water there? In the uh we were on one of the hotel Disney hotels. So it was like one of like the little marshes, sort of like you yeah, know. Yeah, you know, the, the, like the little lakes and things that they put in there. You know there's and, gators in there, right? Not in, in not in, in Disney. Oh yeah, they're right. Well, not the one where my mom was. That's what I should. Oh yeah, there could have been. You it may have not. Have you may been, have not seen not, one. It wasn't a bit. I'm telling you, it was like a, a like a tiny oh, a little, tiny little oh, yeah, okay, like okay. like a a little bit bigger than a bathtub. But okay, like that's, that's what the but yeah. So, um, and it was it was so cute, and I love that. And then the other one was when I almost the geese almost died, but they flew away uh, right there on um by Angel Park. I told the story where the geese uh, were crossing the road and one of oh, them one just got... sat down and didn't want to move anymore. Like they had to have been uh, fighting or something. Yeah. And then got hit but flew away. You I know what, that... Joanne? <laughs> I was just sitting here. Let the car run over me. I bet you'd like that. Yeah. yeah. They yeah. always go across right here on Sahara too, right by Queens Ridge. Yeah. Gosh, I'm like, come on, guys. At least check for traffic it's, first. It stresses me out. And sometimes they use the crosswalk too, which is the weirdest thing. Like, how do you know? Yeah. <laughs> it's so yeah, crazy. seriously. Uh, there's been a few. Uh, there was, uh, you know, I remember like one of my uh, earliest memories. I was at my dad used to be the like the the uh, auctioneer at the MDA telethon in my town, mm -hmm. and there they were like giving out like little like fish mm -hmm. bags for yeah. the kids. Yeah. Little bags of fish, but they were leaking. So like the the fish were running out of water. Oh my god! So now like I started a a, a campaign to save these fish and uh -huh. like was getting new bags, replacing water, doing what I could to like. Yeah. That, I remember that. I also remember um, going to the Walmart and seeing all the fish that were there inside those little cramped cups. Yeah, because oh, they eat each other. <laughs> oh gosh, just not. I know, and you not, just feel bad for. Them. Not a good scene. Um, I'm my mom and I were wa running home in a rainstorm one day, and we heard a tiny little. I talked about jumper before my first mm -hmm, kitty. Mm -hmm. a little tiny mew that we heard inside uh, one of the bushes, and we saved this little kitty. We ended up taking that kitty, and that was our kitty. That's so cute. Uh, and then there was one dog here in Vegas. Uh, I have a. Uh, I have a. a I have a phrase for what this dog was. It was a, and it, it would be an accurate statement to mm -hmm. call this dog this, but a mm, in a ditch, <laughs> and uh, it rhymes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This dog, I'm I'm driving off of Blue Diamond, and all of a sudden I see a dog headed towards Blue Diamond. Mm -hmm. I'm like, that dog is going to get destroyed. Yeah, 55 miles an hour, not a chance. Mm -hmm. So I get out of the car. I'm like, hey, sweetie, hey, come here, come here. Uh -huh. The dog starts racing now. Towards Blue Diamond. I'm like, I literally wrong just got way, this dog murdered. Way. I have to now run after this dog. Uh -huh. So I twist the car around. I go back towards Blue Diamond. I'm like, no, 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 baby. No, 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 no. Starts running down Blue Diamond. I catch up and I like kind of box the dog. Uh -huh. 
and then the dog goes into a ditch. Oh, my God. So, you know, those like little yeah, drainage yeah, ditches yeah. with all the big rocks. So I go into the ditch, and I'm trying to get the dog, and the dog is so not wanting this. Yeah. I finally am able to track down the dog. I'm wheezing because yeah. I don't like exerting energy. It's uh -huh. not my thing. <laughs> uh, I finally get the dog. Of course, I drop my phone in all of these rocks, I get a little yeah. mark on my, one of my on my screen. I'm so infuriated. I take this dog who's just miserable, mm -hmm. throw the dog in the back of my wife's car, where the dog proceeds to poop in the back of the. Uh, <laughs> thank, oh thankfully, it was her car. <laughs> thankfully, it was her car. Uh, but yeah, poops in the back of her car. Gosh. I had a friend that worked at the NSPCA at the time. I'm like, hey. Help. Got a dog from hell. Mm -hmm. The dog was at the NSPCA for months because the dog was an awful terror. Mm -hmm. That dog did not deserve to be saved. Oh, my God. Every dog deserves to nope. be saved. No, that dog did not. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Poor things. Oh, exhausting. Yeah. I don't know. I really don't know what happened with the dog. Like, you know, so Paul, maybe the dog got adopted. Maybe it chilled out eventually. But, yeah. like, I don't know. That dog had some. Maybe it checked itself when it was in, in this doggy slammer for it a while. It checked itself. And then it nearly wrecked itself. <laughs> and I had to step in and save the yeah. dog from itself. <laughs>